are seven weeks old now. In another week, we'll be weaning them. Cinnabons are quite a bit bigger than bunnies, but bunnies are finally starting to catch up. So that's cinnabons. Oh, and this is bonnies. You can see there's quite a difference. They're just one day apart, but remember Bonnie had, Bonnie gave birth to 11, and Cinnabon only gave birth to five. Makes a big difference. And nursing seven of the, the seven survivors makes a big difference over five. Hi, cutie. Hi. So they're doing all really well. I'm really happy with their growth. All right, so this is Ella, and she is the daughter of Ruby and Starbuck, and uh, she has most closely held the black fur of any rabbit that we've raised so far. So we're gonna grow her up and use her as a breeder. Ella, Ella, hi Ella, hi. She's got really good hindquarters. Yes, she's about four and a half months old now. So, hey, can we see your face, Miss Ella? Can we see your pretty face? So another month and a half and then she'll be at breeding age. And she's got Ruby's personality without having Starbucks hyperness. So that is really good. Okay, I just want to show you how big Xander's gotten. I still haven't gotten a birth date out of the breeder. I don't know, they won't respond. Kept saying they'd send it and then they won't respond now, so I don't know. But I think he's about two weeks younger than Ella. But he's doing really well. He's growing really well. His hindquarters are developing nicely. And he's super friendly. Hey, hey. Okay, now this is Jasper, and he is the son of Miss Serena and Starbuck, and he is the grandson of Serenity and Leo. And we've decided that we're growing up another buck, um, because right now we can't breed Leo and we may never be able to breed Leo again. Um, we're gonna grow up Jasper and uh, see how he does. He may end up getting sold, but he's definitely not gonna be a butcher bunny. Jasper, he's got everything that I want in a white. He's got the big hindquarters. I mean, he's still only four and a half months old, so it'll be a bit before he's completely filled out, but the way he's shaping up is really nice here. He's got the big meaty hindquarters, and he has got, so he's got that from his grandfather, and he's got the delicate features and the super soft fur from his father, his grandmother, and his mother. Hey, hey, hey Jasper. So this is what I've been breeding for with the big, the, the best meat rabbit, the best fur rabbit to get something like this. And he's got Starbucks personality, although not quite as hyperactive. So that's good. Hey, hey. Oh, it's okay, honey, it's okay. So anyway, that is the state of the kits right now.